And uh, you, we mentioned that your final uh, match on pay-per-view with that is was that um, Vengeance, uh, Night of Champions. Uh, unfortunately, kind of got overshadowed because Chris Benoit didn't turn up and then people didn't know what happened. A few days later, the truth came out and uh, it was just su- such a sad story to hear about and such a tragedy. I mean, growing up, I loved Benoit. He was one of my guys growing up and then hearing what happened people said like he was like around the locker room they said he was never erratic but he was always intense was the word um it must have hit you like a ton of bricks when you actually heard what happened especially with the rest of the boys like chavo and all of them when they heard about it um it must have just been complete and utter shock well yeah it's you dealing originally you're at first you're dealing with the grief of losing somebody so important to you and so um that was so integrated in the wrestling business and for me personally you know he's the one that helped get the eyes on me that i couldn't get initially on my for myself you know what i mean so i had a a connection with him and that um you're dealing with that grief and then you find out um how the 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 true events went it's fuck man it's a gut punch you yeah. know what I mean? Like it's yeah. It, it, I don't know any other way to explain it, but it's a gut punch. And and I didn't know him nearly as well as guys like Scott Armstrong, Chavo Guerrero. Yeah. Um, you know those were his riding buddies. Um, and I and and also I didn't know about the struggles that he was going through after with Eddie. You know all of that came yeah. out. You know nobody knew that. You know. Um, so it's it's a heartbreaking situation and and you don't want to believe that that person could have no. been capable of such horrendous events. Yeah. Um, so you just, uh, the most you can do, man, is um, you pray for Nancy and his boy and you, uh, you pray for his soul, you know, yeah. someday it finds peace, man. Cause that's, shit man even just in the wrestling business if anybody you know not even just in the wrestling if you heard that from you know your regular job somebody did it at your regular job it would just yeah you know it's a gut punch you know what i mean yeah. but let alone somebody that well known um and you just ask yourself you know like man there were plenty of times like he should have there are plenty of people that would have helped him you know what i mean if, if it just would have spoke up you know what i mean 